Haley. I think he just met Malcolm, which is my cat. Um, my black and white dog, that is Reese. And then my brown dog, which is Dewey. They're my little babies. I love them so much. Like, it's hard to describe unless you have your own dog and, like, animal and cat. And animals, dogs and cats. Like, growing up, if you have a family animal, it's just kind of different. Like, they're your childhood pet, but then when you actually care for your own little fur baby, it's like a completely different type of love. Anyways, every time I talk about them, I get like way, way, way too emotional. That's okay. Um, this morning, I just went and got Starbucks, brushed my teeth, got ready. I say I got ready, but I've been wearing this since last night. It's um, a gray sweatshirt from Amazon, a white Old Navy tank that I thrifted from running shorts, shorts and some Air Forces. I'm probably going to wear this again today because I'm just lazy and I, if you can see behind me, it might be too dark. Um, my house is a disaster. I haven't cleaned it all week. Truthfully, I've kind of been depressed, but that's okay. Everyone gets in these little ruts, but just like getting yourself out of it that matters I guess but that's the hardest part like nobody talks about getting out of the rut everyone just talks about being in it and getting out of it is probably even harder than being in it if you ask me but whatever I'm like out of breath I don't know why I like I think when I talk fast or like feel overwhelmed I start to stutter and like lose my breath that's okay. You're seeing all of me today, but my agenda today is to clean my house because it's just a disaster and do my laundry. And I gave the boys actually, yesterday we had like a really busy day. Well, I didn't. Ricky is my boyfriend, I live with him. This is a picture of him. Let's get this focus that's my lovely boyfriend he just had surgery for his ACL and the nights are like a lot harder for him because he like can't get comfortable because his leg has to be like in this brace and like in locked in extension and it's just yeah it's really sad if... <laughs> I can't say anything else about it it's just very sad um, so yeah, I'm going to try to clean my apartment. I really, I got these muffins at the beginning of the week to make. They're just like... Banana nut muffins. I got like walnuts to go with them, but like I said, I got them like Monday and now it's Saturday. And I just like need to make them because... <laughs> I feel like it will make me feel productive and they'll stop sitting on my counter so that's nice uh, fun fact last week was the worst week of my life but one of the reasons why is because our house got infested with ants I don't know how but there was a whole ant colony coming in through our front door down to our kitchen got into our cabinets and everything if um it lets me i'll insert a picture right here of like them being on like our honey and syrup is disgusting so now i'm taking advantage of having no ants and being able to leave these on my counter but yeah i don't think it was our fault because we i know i just said i'm depressed i haven't cleaned my house but I'll show you my house in a second. It's usually not this messy, but this week was an exemption. And okay, we don't usually, we never really have dishes or dishwasher. We like do our dishes and we clean like the counter spaces really quick. Like we've always been good about keeping the kitchen clean. And we still had ants. And we have some friends that live in the same apartment complex that us that have ants as well. And I know our neighbors have ant had ants. So I think it's just the landscape in which our apartment complex is made on like the foundation because if that makes any sense because it's all like desert landscape and there's ant hills everywhere so 
yeah i don't know how i got on that topic but i want to make these so i can take advantage of not having ants and being able to leave them on my counter and enjoy them and just look at them and just appreciate them even if i don't eat them i just want to appreciate that i made them and how beautiful they look so i will show you my apartment right now let me prop you up this is what i'm working with this is my laundry hamper this is where the real crisis is oh you can see the boys <sighs> not going to be your best friends they're only two weeks apart so they're always doing everything together but this is my living room disaster don't know how this happened i don't have a baby this is for dewey because like 75 percent of the day i don't know if i said this he has a broken leg so 75 percent of the time he has to be um like um in a small confined area so that his leg doesn't get a whole bunch of weight put on it all day and so that it heals properly so that's where i'm at in life so you know when you have like so many things to do you don't know where to start yeah that's me right now i have no idea where to start i have you guys in my little cabinet oh my gosh i got the cutest shot glass like a long time ago look how little cute this is a harley davidson shot glass if you want it, I'll sell it for five million dollars. to this place called I think it's called Lily's Market and we got this grape from Muse and we got it in mango and strawberry and then we got a few of these Thai teas kitchen now Ricky's finishing getting ready and um, then we have to go to the body shop because last weekend uh, we got rear-ended so we have to go to the body shop to get like an estimate for the repairs it's adult things that you like don't want to do fun Luckily, the kitchen is pretty clean. I don't really have to do anything. Ricky just yelled because we haven't cooked, which is. We cooked literally the other night. Did we not make pitas? No. Oh, what did we make then? In and out. We haven't had in and out in months. And ages. It's just being a troll. But yeah, luckily it's pretty clean. So, don't really have to, it more just like, it's like, um, like dog hair and cat hair on it, which is gross. But understandable, if you have animals, you know. Like, if you have animals, you know, you, if you know, you know. I'm sorry. I swear, we've lived here for like, how long have we lived here? For seven months. For seven months, and we've used the microwave five times. Literally. And the only reason we've used it is to make dumplings from Trader Joe's. So, I don't know if that's a 
achievement or if we're doing something wrong. But that's that. Now I can show you my apartment because it's decently clean. Let's just hope that the Roomba takes care of the rest. Honestly, no, nothing makes my life better than the Roomba. Like, especially <laughs> if you have animals, because their hair just gets on everything and everywhere. Okay, I'll show you my apartment now that it's clean. Let's do the kitchen because probably the cleanest. So dark, but this is our kitchen. It's pretty clean. This is um, the playpen that I was talking about that Dewey has to be in most of the day. And then it's kind of hard to see because it's the windows. Maybe let me come over here. Makes it look dark, but. It is clean. I don't know if I showed you a good before. Hey, and there's Ricky. The grappling comes out. Aw, so handsome. Hello guys. How how do you do? <laughs> how do you do? Um, I was just telling them how we're about to go to the body shop. Yeah. Let's get our car looked at. Make it pocket Ricky said make his pockets hurt. Whoever hit us, whoever hit us. <laughs> They're gonna rule that thing. Honestly, their car was a lot worse than ours. But it was the principle of the action. Because <laughs> we were already having a bad day. So it made it 10 times worse. Malcolm. Malcolm is a nosy Nelly. Okay. We're off. Yeah. <laughs> and now we're getting tacos. Tacos TJ, I'm so excited. So we're about to feast. Eat really good. Eat really, really good. It's like a reward for going through hiking. Yeah. And then we yeah. have to go grocery shopping. She one. tricked me. You did not tell me we're going grocery shopping today. I did. I'm so shocked. At least you get a, I'm gonna at least, sue. At least you get a ride in the wheelchair thing. I have oh to walk. yeah. <laughs> if you guys if you guys are wondering, Trader Joe's has the fastest little wheelchairs. The electric what are they wheelchairs. Called? Electric chairs. No. <laughs> <laughs> they have the fastest wheelchairs. They have the fastest go-karts. Right? Yeah, go-karts. Store go <laughs> store <laughs> so store. Go Go karts. They have the fastest store go kart. That's hard to say. Say that five times. Fastest store go karts. Fastest store go karts. Go karts. Go karts. They have the fastest go karts in the world. But yeah, we'll, we'll give you an overview when we get our food. So, this is what I got. Classic little tacos. She got flour tacos. Disgusting. But. Let me get this prepared a little bit. Do you get forks? So far, our chop is not that good, according to Haley's face. Let's see. Let me be the judge of that. That's oh, it's very grainy. Not bad, though. Not bad. <laughs> the thing about tacos Tijuana sauce, it's going to be spicy. I like to put a little bit of everything on it, you know. Taste test. Right, we're back from the grocery store. 
laid on the couch for a little bit. Ricky's watching skate videos. I was editing this video. Um, I want to do a quick little grocery haul. It's not really groceries. It's just like random things we need from Walmart. We don't usually shop at Walmart just because it's just like... I like shopping at smaller stores because sometimes I get really overwhelmed because I'm sensitive and like big stores with lots of people like claustrophobic with so when we go to Walmart I try to do Walmart pickup now because it's a blessing and it's free so but this is just like I didn't put the pickup in because the earliest it said was three and then we ended up being out getting there at three and I just didn't manage my time properly but <clears throat> I got some Not Your Mother's 10 in 1 Hair Protector Perfector. I got it mostly for heat protectant because I use like Tresemme heat protectant and I feel like it doesn't do anything so I wanted to try this one. And then we got little leggings. They're for Dewey. <laughs> Let's pull one out. I actually want to see. They're for Dewey because he will lick his cast and like around his leg and like get it all wet and stuff so we buy we did this with reese too we like bought them leggings and then just like cut out a little hole for their booty so like their tail can go through so we just bought these are actually so cute they're like kind of like a brown and white he has a he has a well reese's old ones are gray and white but doing it's a little bit thicker so we have to get a size bigger and then we got just like these little sweats for him too. I feel like I sound crazy, but it's for his own good. And then we're out of shampoo and conditioner. And I swear we've tried every shampoo and conditioner um, in the world. And what we've come to the conclusion is these are our favorites. It's the Herbal Essence. Oh, I thought this exploded. Um, we get these herbal essence ones, the ca the chamomile. What do you call these, Ricky? What flavor do you say this is? Uh, cocoa melon. <laughs> you say something else. Is it chamomile? Chamomile, <laughs> like chamomile. Okay, and we got those because we swear they're the best ones. I don't know. We've just tried everything. Like our friends have recommended them stuff. Our parents have. This is just what works best. And got these. And then we just got a little bag of Halloween candy because I don't really think you need a reason to buy Halloween candy. You just buy it. So that was our little haul. Those are just random. Well, candy we didn't need but everything else for like things we've been needing and I haven't been able to order off Amazon because I keep forgetting so yeah um tonight I think my brothers are coming over and we're gonna do a viewing party of Lock and Key we're all we all watched the first season like separately and then realized that we'd all watched it and so now the sec we watched the first season I think I said the second so then tonight we're watching the second season because we've all seen it and we're all we all are obsessed with it. So they'll probably come over and watch a movie with us. Make dinner, get dinner. And that's kinda like our night. I'll keep you guys posted. I think I'm going to I have to do a few tests for work. Um that I need to finish. Or yeah, do a few of them. So I'm probably gonna do that. And then um see where the night takes us honestly so i'll pick you guys up next time that we are doing something i cleaned the house but i didn't make my muffins so should i make the muffins now or tomorrow whatever you feel like baby you said you wanted a what was it a cannoli That's yeah it. i did want to stop and get a cannoli because we have like a uh, bakery right next to our apartment and they're from London they're based in London and I think they don't fake their accents yeah Ricky thinks they fake their accents but they don't nobody fakes accents well, well like in a, in, a, in a workplace nobody's gonna be like faking an accent I never know 
It literally says their family owned Never her. Own. It's called the Great Gatsby Bakery. It's like the best bakery I've ever been to in my life, honestly. They have like these amazing sugar cookies and then I think it's a cannoli. It's like this little pastry that has like whipped cream and like berries and cream and then another like little pastry on top. It's so good. It's honestly, anything you get there is amazing. I am obsessed with it. I try not to go like maybe just like once a month because otherwise it's addicting. Like it's just like the way their whipped cream tastes like doesn't even taste like regular whipped cream. Like it's not too sweet and it's not too not sweet. It's just so like, ugh, I want some. Ricky got me like their stuff for my birthday. Like I think my birthday was last week or the week before. And they got me like a cheesecake and like, like literally just like a whole little buffet of treats from there. And they were so good. Like um, when I blew out my candles, we like t taste tested like a piece of Sorry if I was out of focus this whole time. Taste tested a piece of each and they're so divine. We got like red velvet cupcakes. We got like a little like pie thing. It's just amazing. Ricky's just being Ricky. He's being a troll. But if you guys are ever in Arizona and live in Gilbert, they are the best. They gave me food poisoning. No, they didn't. Also, nothing but cakes is also one of our favorites. We are like sluts for their like little mini bentlets. Ricky loves red velvet, so we always get like red velvet everything. You're a red velvet stan. I am, I love red velvet. It's kind of random, it's just red velvet's chocolate. Do you know that? Yeah, I know that. <laughs> tell me that every so, time. So why don't you just get chocolate? You tell me that every single time I get red velvet. You know it's chocolate. It's chocolate. It's chocolate. It's chocolate. It's chocolate. It's chocolate. It's Dude, you're so over your shit today. Hey, vlog. Okay, so it's like 8.15. My boys have been chilling all day. Dewey's been napping, Markham's been napping, Reese has been napping, and Ricky's been playing skate for like the past four hours. And uh, it's 8.15. We didn't end up doing the... Uh, show watching party so now but we are watching that later today yeah we're going to watch it I, I'm craving to watch it like, you're craving? I'm craving it <laughs> I, I need to watch it <laughs> so we're gonna do that we just spent an hour deciding what we we're gonna do for dinner and we've come to the conclusion we're going Eating out, out. <laughs> like always ah. hey it's vacation it's surgery vacation by the way if any of you guys care my leg is, uh, dang, that looks all fucked up. It's Catch supposed to be straight, man. but it, it goes straight when I go like this. It's just not straight when I lift it. So anticlimactic. But if you ever, like, want to plan ahead, don't ever tear your ACL. <laughs> <laughs> it, it sucks. It yeah. sucks a lot. If you, if you can avoid it, please avoid it. Yeah. Don't mm -hmm. recommend like zero out of ten. Would Sucks. recommend. Sucks. I'm Super uncomfortable all things. the time. Like, there is no point in time when you're comfortable at all. But um, yeah, Malcolm, just don't Malcolm's tear been loving out. the snuggles lately. You'll go. You'll go sleep in the Are in the okay? boys' pen. He goes and sleep in the boys' pen by himself. He loves it. He loves it way more than the boys. He thinks it's his own personal little, like... Like, palace. Yeah, his own personal little palace. And then he tries to jump out of there and biffs it all the time. He, like, mis, mis, mis angles it or mis, uh... Calculates, calculates it, it. And he'll, like, biff it jumping out of it. And it's so funny. Yeah, it's pretty funny. It's, like, sad, but... It's, like, funny sad. Um, so, for dinner, we came to the conclusion of... Drumroll... No, <laughs> it's We came to the conclusion that we're gonna go get rolls from Texas Roadhouse. Uh. <laughs> and uh, that's really all the vibes we have planned so far. Maybe a salad. Perhaps not. Perhaps not. <laughs> oh, you've never seen White Chicks, huh? No. We can watch White Chicks too. Bro, I've asked you to watch that shit. Well, like, I've never been in the mood. And and that and that saying made me remind me that I could be in the mood to watch it. Mm -hmm. All of a sudden, all of a sudden. Ping ping ping! Girls, girls, girls! Clear, clear, girl! Girls, girls, girls! Together, forever. Leave me alone. 
Okay, Julie. <laughs> why do you think why you, why like you that? act like that? Why are you, you saying my nose wants me? <laughs> <laughs> As you can tell, we're going crazy. Yeah. It's been a Ricky. whole week of us Ricky being hates me. I actually do the opposite of that and I love her. But love, love, love. Pink, pink, pink. She's girls, 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 girls. Yeah, we've literally just been in the house for like the last week. We only leave to get food, get snacks, or go to physical therapy. And take Dewey to the doctor. And take Dewey to the doctor, and I go outside and take them on walks. We go to, I didn't realize how, many, how hard that is to take two dogs on a walk like five times a day by yourself because i've been so blessed to have ricky either do it half the time or we go together when we're home together and it is so hard like the other day they tangled me up and i fell <laughs> ricky still is laughing about it but i was i was tied to pit. so the story is you guys probably don't care but dewey pooped on the sidewalk right in front of our neighbor so i had to pick it up but i didn't have a you bag always have to pick it up. <laughs> i always have to pick it up but i didn't have a bag so i had to like walk around the building to go to where they have like the dog bag station and then i had to walk back and she was still there with her cat because she was walking her cat and i'm as i'm picking it up reese runs around me to go look at the cat and dewey's running the other way around me and I went to take a step, and then when I took a step, it like pulled, so I fell. Like a like a like a Star Wars scene. Yeah, like a Star Wars scene, I guess. And uh, it was just so embarrassing. And I came upstairs, and I was like almost crying because I was having a meltdown. And that's the that is just me being a single mother working <laughs> so hard. But yeah, okay, we're gonna go get ready for dinner, even though this is what we're wearing. And make sure all my boys are are safe. They're sleeping. Malcolm's over here feasting. Just want to do a brief PSA. The reason why half the clips look good quality and the other half look bad quality is because I'm using my camera, but I keep switching to my phone because it's either my camera's dying or um I'm gonna get a cuteness shot yeah i just need it in the moment shot and so that's why the quality keeps differing like right now it's on my um phone because my camera i tried to shoot on my camera and it's dead so i need to charge it and i'm really bad at just like charging it all the way i just charge it halfway so i'm gonna start charging it overnight so hopefully you guys don't have such a quality difference between each video just want to add or between each clip just want to add that in i think he's so precious i can't even focus when i have a dupe over here Alright, I forgot to vlog at dinner, but went to Texas Roadhouse, ate some rolls, shared a burger, then uh, we came home. I'm sipping my prickly pear beer, which ever since I went to Diego Pops, they have this prickly pear margarita. It is two die for. It's probably the best margarita or just like cocktail type drink I've ever had in my life. I go during happy hour. It's like five bucks for a, a happy hour drink. It's so good. So when I saw this prickly pear, I was like, I need to try it. My first reaction when I tried it was it tastes like a very light beer, but the aftertaste is like very sweet, which is I've never had a sweet beer, and this is amazing. I really like it. I'll for sure have to get it again. The can is like purple and it has some cactuses on it. We just got it at our, normal, our local gas station. It's amazing. But I think that wraps up the vlog. Um, it's like 11.13. Are we staying up or are we going to bed?
Oh, what kind of food? I'll watch one show of uh, Blackie Heat. We're gonna watch one show and then we're gonna go to bed. And I'll probably edit this tomorrow and see when I can get it up. But yeah, I had a lot of fun bringing you guys along with my day. Even though it was not as productive, did not finish the laundry, did not do my nails. It's a great day though. Stop what is it? It was a great day. It was a great day. It was a great day. Malcolm's messing up my couch right now with his scratch. Not his though. But yeah, hopefully tomorrow I will pick up the vlog, pick up the camera again. Actually be productive because tomorrow is my last day off. So I have to get my life together. So hopefully tomorrow we'll be super productive. I'll wake up early and see what the day has in store for us. But, all right, good night.